I'm here right now at the Sustainability Festival at CU, which is the initiative of a group of students um, who are in their first year of their master's studies at CU. Um, basically, we have many different events going on related to sustainability, what students can do to get involved, raising awareness, um, basically drawing attention to the issue of climate change. A group of us, um, I'm from the Environmental Studies Department, Environmental Sciences Department, sorry. And a group of us got together and we were just thinking, you know, we need to do something about sustainability at CEU. It's the 8th of October, and on the 10th of October there will be a global work party, like a day that will unite people all around the world to actually working, doing something concrete to fight climate change. We have a couple of workshops that are going on. For example, we're making wallets out of recycled juice boxes. We have an eco quiz. We have a flip chart that people can put their ideas on because we're really trying to get people's opinions. This is a 350 baobab tree. There are little holes in the trunk. So the idea is that when you cover all the holes, which takes at least four or five people to do it, then all the bunches will go up. I can't show it now because I'm alone, so alone I cannot fight climate change. So the idea is that only if we act together at the same time, we can fight climate change. We're here today as CEU students, and we're actually taking discarded um, milk carton Tetra packs and turning them into wallets. It's a really simple process. Um, you just kind of manipulate and rearrange and fold the carton and make a few cuts, add a few, add some tape for detail, and add some Velcro, then you have yourself a really good, sturdy, waterproof wallet. So, probably you also drink coffee, or actually I do drink a lot, uh, at least two coffees per day, but I never think on from where it comes from and how it um, arrives here in my cup. So, we wanted to show that even when you are doing like, um, you are um, drinking coffee every day, just think about it and uh, try to make it uh, as, more, as sustainable as you can. So we really want to leave a legacy for the school itself and for students who are going to be coming in in future years to know that we can do something real and practical about sustainability at CEU.